Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You guys, when they say that the economy is not doing good, it's definitely not doing good because even Kylie Jenner is struggling financially. So recently, Kylie Jenner has launched her clothing line called Kai. She has a plan to celebrate the launch of her brand. She decided to order a cake for this event. So an event planning team contacted Yip Studio, which is owned by Amy Yip, who makes very beautiful cakes. And they asked her to make a cake for Kylie and her celebration for Kylie's brand. So obviously, Amy was quite excited and uh, she said that she cleared off her whole schedule for the upcoming opportunity of making the cake for Kylie Jenner and she was quite excited about the opportunity and uh, I can understand because it would have been a great exposure for her brand and uh, Amy said that she also made the whole deck and the inspiration for the cake and she didn't charge them anything for it all of these ideas and shared with the team and Kylie's team I mean the event managing team kept Amy hanging. And then when she finally received an email from them, they mentioned that they don't have the budget for her cake. So Amy was rightfully infuriated and she took to Instagram stories, shared all of this matter and soon after that, Kylie's team approached her and asked her to take down the stories. And Amy stood her ground and she said that she didn't sign an NDA with them so she's free to do whatever she wants to, which is fair. And I'm on this girl's side because uh, Kylie, the last time I checked is super rich and not just her her whole family is super rich and she's almost a billionaire i guess so imagine getting approached by such an amazingly famous and rich person and you see this opportunity to put your small brand your small business out there and then that filthy rich person tells you that they don't have the budget to buy a cake from you so amy's cake pricing is kind of fair for rich people i guess because the smallest cakes are 300 dollars and the biggest are almost $700 and I think it's just pocket change for Kylie she wouldn't even notice if somebody spent $300 or $700 from her entire wealth and uh, Amy said that they should have known this before reaching out to me and using the status of their client to get away with wasting my time which is fair she said that if they would have said that they are not doing the desserts anymore she would have understood but saying that they don't have the budget for it doesn't make any sense and people on Reddit are making fun of Kylie because it's quite funny. I mean, it doesn't uh, make any sense. This, this cake kind of looks like the Kai cake a little bit, like the white buttercream or whatever that is. And then the roses, the strawberries. And then she wraps up the whole thing by saying that a lot of other people have had this experience with other businesses and they them getting knocked off. And then Reddit was going crazy. People were saying Kardashians say, get the up and work. And then how people actually work and the Kardashians say, we ain't gonna pay you for the work. And basically, all the big parties they do have been sponsored so they haven't really taken money out of their pocket to pay for these big extravagant elaborate parties and then this person said no one is cheaper than a rich person and kylie is rich she has kylie skin kylie cosmetics kai private airplanes <laughs> she was even listed as forbes 30 under 30 for being a billionaire so it's very interesting that they reached out to the small business but then they said they couldn't afford it but i guess they're still too cheap that's embarrassing for the family somebody else commented billionaire that can't even afford a cake that's a little embarrassing <laughs> Now, some people are saying that this may might be because uh, they expected the baker to just do it for free or very cheap because um, obviously a small business always wants some exposure, especially from the people who have massive PR and they're famous. I mean, I owned a small business once and it was very, very early on in my business. I had a very small jewelry shop online and I had just started and the first ever order I received from a blogger in my country she was kind of famous and she had good following now this blogger ordered a ring from me and uh, she didn't respond to me when i told her that this is the payment method and you can transfer me the money and i can send you the ring this girl gave me her whole address just to send her the ring and then i understood that why is she doing that because i'm a small business and she's a famous person so from what i understand she wanted me to just take up the hint and send her the ring for the exposure for my small business i guess it's a very common thing that famous and uh, powerful people do to small businesses because they expect them to go after exposure and not charge them for their hard-earned money but people are saying that kylie kind of expected and her team just expected that uh, she would do it for free because come on it's kylie and getting your name your brand associated with kylie would have been a big win for her 
Okay, so there is more to the Kylie Jenner cake drama and watch my last video to understand what the heck is going on. So after Amy had posted on IG stories regarding what had happened with the event planner and Kylie Jenner, she ended up taking down all her stories. In one of her stories, she had shared that she didn't sign an NDA, so people were like, well, did Kylie just pay you off to take those stories down? Amy posted on her IG stories that today Kylie had actually reached out and apologized and also expressed that she's kind of terrified of what people with that type of money can do and just wanted to get back to making cakes. But wait. So Amy had posted on her IG stories about the situation on Tuesday and now it makes sense why Kylie and her team were scrambling for Amy to take these down. She had posted this to her stories showing the deck she had made for the event planner to show like what kind of cakes she could make for Kylie. But in the story, Amy also showed that Kylie Jenner had a perfume coming out called Cosmic which hadn't been announced yet. So today Kylie announced her new perfume Cosmic which comes out March the 7th. And with all these floors and this particular shot right here, it makes sense why the event planner reached out to Amy. This image of Kylie right here literally looks like Amy's cakes. And yeah, that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please consider subscribing and check out my Pinterest in the description box below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!